We all know that California is waiting for the next big earthquake. I guess waiting for is the wrong term, but the famous San Andreas Fault hasn't produced a quake that's done extensive damage since the 1906 one that tore apart San Francisco. But it's due. Scientists say there's enough stress to produce a 7.0 magnitude earthquake. So that's not good, but it's about to get worse. Recent work by scientists is finding that the adjacent San Jacinto Fault is locked and loaded as well, and they could slide at the same time. It's thought to have already happened once that we know of in 1820. 12, in which a San Jacinto quake set off the San Andreas. Now, the scary news is yes, whether it happens in tandem or not, these faults will have earthquakes. The United States Geological Survey is saying the strongest earthquake they'd predict for California along the San Andreas alone would be an 8.3. The guess that would cause about 200 billion in damage, injure 50,000 people, and kill about 2,000. They say what would be bad afterwards is the damage to the water system, which is already under a strain from the drought. Running water and sewage might not be operational and they suspect people would quit on California. But come on, only for so long. That weather would make anyone try and try again. I'm Patrick Jones for Buzz 60. Now you know, pass it on.